wanted to show just a quick tip video on uh, what, how I use the uh, Harbor Freight dollies. These are the smaller ones. Um, sometimes you can catch these at like $5 for, for one of these and then you do the 20% discount. Um, but on average price, I think they're $10. Um, and even with a 20% discount, it's still pretty cheap. But uh, what I use these for is I have a few of them to move things around, but I also use these for the three inch caster. So I don't know if you've ever been working on a project like, for example, uh, all of my shop furniture is on wheels. And uh, when you're looking at, you know, just making stuff for the shop or even whenever you need these casters, these can get pretty expensive when you're, when you're doing, you know, quite a few carts. So these are three inch casters, they swivel. Uh, they're, I've used them for years and they're extremely heavy duty, which is awesome. Um, but I'm going to just show you what I do to these. I'll just take a, uh, a knife here and just cut the edges off. And you'll see why here. So let me pull up this carpeted area here. I'm going to do that to the other side. I'll use a uh, driver here on that. That's it. I just remove all the all the nuts here. The cool thing too is I'll show you here. So now I have all the casters that I can use, and then I'll uh, take a hammer, take these guys out, you just give them a pop. And then just like a nail, just pull them out. And these, sometimes I'll use the wood. I mean, it's cheap. It's like poplar and then plywood. I'll, sometimes I'll use that as just scrap material for some other project. But um, the cool thing about this is, is not only are you getting the casters, which are three inches, and usually these are, on average, I think they're about, it can range between three to about $7, depending on where you buy them, per, per wheel. And doing it this way leaves them at about, you know, like a dollar and some change. Um, but here's the other cool thing. I keep all these things, all the bolts, and it has locking nuts. So what I do is I use these for um, future projects. So I have a whole bin full of locking nuts. And um, so it basically pays for itself just off of, off of these uh, bolts and everything that I get to keep outside of that. So hopefully somebody else finds that helpful and uh, just, you know, a better way and a cheaper way to uh, make shop furniture and uh, not have to spend so much.